We are living in unprecedented times and we're finding ourselves experiencing a lot of changes, unpredictability and uncertainty. The coronavirus pandemic has the capacity to activate the fight or flight stress response in all of us to varying degrees. Human beings are the only species that can think themselves into a stress response through thought alone. And when we find ourselves going to fight or flight mode, we may experience symptoms such as heart palpitations, heavy breathing, racing thoughts, sweaty palms. And so today I want to share with you three practical tips that you can apply at home as a means of deactivating the fight or flight stress response. Name it to tame it, breathing and grounding through the five senses. Now with name it to tame it, I want you to think about using eye language and acknowledging the feelings that you're experiencing at present, because what we resist will persist. So to be able to sit with difficult emotions is a skill all on its own. I feel anxious. I feel overwhelmed. I feel sad. I feel scared. So these are ways of naming it to tame it. And by doing this, you're sending soothing neurotransmitters to the limbic brain, which is our emotional brain. And this helps calm down the system as a whole. The second tip being four, seven, eight breathing. And what this means is inhaling for four seconds, holding for seven seconds, exhaling for eight seconds. This helps with reducing anxiety levels as well as improving sleep. The third being grounding through the five senses. And so I want you to take a look around the room. What are five things that I can see? What are four things that I can hear? What are three things that I can smell? Two things that I can um, touch and one thing that I can taste. And so when it is that you find yourself feeling anxious or that the stress response has been activated, I want you to try these three practical tips at home.